This is a message from the Universal Secret Service and Intelligence Agency. Asia. This is a warning to all human beings worldwide. We are fighting a big mess in this world. Of all serious problems there can only be one the most destroying. The most destroying and most merciless problem of all. The Religious Mormonism Organization In this video we will present you the only truth about the evil Mormonism organization. And we will also present you the full identities of the top of the evil Mormonism organization. The Father called Elohim, the Wife, the Holy Spirit, the Son called Jehovah, and the Daughter. The only truth about the evil Mormonism organization. The evil Mormonism organization was established purely for the sick pornography desire and the ego of the Father. One of Elohim's goals is that he wants you to be the same evil sexually abusing person as he is. This instead of you being an angry victim who will be Elohim's destruction. For that goal the father builded a system with a wife, a holy spirit, a son, and a daughter. To have the confidence of humanity to be able to sexually abuse as many love relations, men, women and children, as possible. And to destroy all of those who do not want to be part of his system. As a group they travel systematically through complete humanity. Because of this the Asiya started with an offensive to curb these huge human rights violations. From the evil Mormonism view. Al Lucifer was born. And the evil Mormonism organization started a war over complete humanity. The evil Mormonism organization confronted complete humanity with the hard claim. You have to choose. Or Jehovah. Or Lucifer, the Asya. In other words. Or you do accept the human rights violations and be part of the evil Mormonism organization. And live in the folly Mormonism is good, and Lucifer, the Asya, is evil. Or you will support the fight against the evil Mormonism organization. And remain the clear look that the Mormonism organization is evil, and Lucifer, the Asya, cares about existence. But does the evil Mormonism organization leaves you a fair choice with this? Of course the answer is no. When you choose not to be part of the evil Mormonism organization, and you do not wish to accept the presence of the evil Mormonism organization in your existence. In other words, you want to be free in your own free will, and you want your right of inviolability of body and mind to be respected. The evil Mormonism organization lives in the folly you are evil, and you need to be destroyed. But when you choose to be part of the evil Mormonism organization, there is the law of nature. Evil human beings go to hell. Literally. And so will you. And this, the evil Mormonism organization knows very well. The only aim the evil Mormonism organization serves, is making as many victims as possible. Purely because the evil Mormonism organization knows they go to hell. And they want to take as many innocent victims as possible with them. This is why the Asiya is working hard to destroy the evil Mormonism organization. Including their faces. Which organization is formed by the following evil ones. Presenting themselves as friends. But with an evil plan in their minds for which plan they spend many years to accomplish their goal. Presenting you the biggest rats in the history of existence. Responsible for the largest genocide in history, 
the most gruesome human rights violations, and the largest numbers of raped love relations, adults, and children. Together they have made billions and billions of victims all over the world. And somewhere we all know. Presenting two of the evil fathers. At the moment Dutch intelligence and security service AIVD employees, calling themselves Willem. The evil father, Willem Brouwer, Zoutbommel, the Netherlands, on his way to be destroyed. Presenting the evil wife, Nelly Furtado. The evil wife, Nelly Furtado, on her way to be destroyed. Presenting two of the evil holy spirits. At the moment one of them is a Dutch intelligence and security service AIVD employee. Calling himself Eric. The Evil Holy Spirit. Eric Wuisman, Weert, the Netherlands. On his way to be destroyed. Presenting the Evil Son or Jehovah. Yuri Wanders, Gerichem, the Netherlands. Presenting the Evil Son or Jehovah. Yuri Wanders, Gerichem, the Netherlands. On his way to be destroyed. Presenting the Evil Daughter, Emery the Joing, Rotterdam, the Netherlands. Presenting the evil daughter. Emery the Joing, Lare, Gelderlad, the Netherlands. Presenting one of Elohim his queens. The former queen of the Netherlands, Princess Beatrix. She preferred a life as a queen, bathed in luxury, above the welfare of many innocent victims. And she also preferred the lust of Elohim, above the love of these victims. How you can be mistaken by faces. What you can do. Please, choose for yourself. Law of Nature. Evil human beings are not sad. The evil Mormonism organization presents itself as victim of Lucifer, the Usir. Don't let the evil Mormonism organization fool you. Law of Nature A religious look is a clouded look. The origin of existence is non-religious. The evil Mormonism organization is living in one big lie. By which it is also destroying itself. Don't let the evil Mormonism organization destroy you. 
law of nature, an existence for God, power, status, money and lust is finite. And God wants it all, and wants you to believe he is right. So your existence is finite too. Law of nature. Evil human beings living in the folly to be good human beings are untreatable. Better a witty fool, than a foolish wit. For victims good to know. Nice funny people go to paradise and will live in immortality. Freed from the evil ones. Victims have something to rely on. Law of nature. No government, organization or human being rules above the Asya. Law of nature. Evil fears good. For more information, contact the Asya. Info at asya.org. To the evil Mormonism organization. Law of nature. You create a living hell, you will live a living hell. And all of this, just for the desire of lust.